Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Star Flames. In this video, I have some juicy details to share with you guys. I know that you aren't ready, right? We're not ready, but we're ready. We've been ready for this. Everyone who supports Ye and his new wife, Bianca, I believe we are ready for it. No, all across Twitter, Instagram, Ye's friends are saying, He's coming back to crack head, heads open, right? Now, Bianca Sensori, bestie, Che Anderson is saying that Sensei says it is time. Guys, I'm learning that Ye has a new nickname since marrying Bianca. And it's called Sensei, okay? So, Che is saying that. Sensei is saying they are ready. Sensei referring to Ye and Bianca. Listen. I don't know if it's Bianca, if it's that Bianca is coming back to Instagram. I don't know if they're coming with a couple's page, but I think it is something bigger than that. Because if Che is going to tweet and say, Sensei is saying it is time. It means that they are about to launch something epic, something amazing, something outside of the box, something that none of us are ready for, okay? No. When you look at the word sensei, it's given the sense that, as I said, it's come from it's coming from Bianca. It's also giving the sense that they're talking about teacher, master, because when he was canceled, do not be fooled. He had a lot of people supporting him. Even his Jewish friends were supporting him, you know, behind the scenes. They weren't up front, but they were supporting him and they were also reassuring him that You've got this. You can do this. And I'm going to come back and tell you about a story that I've been lingering to tell you guys about because many Jewish members see the cancellation against Ye as Ari Emanuel's jealousy towards him. It's, it wasn't about the Jewish community because they're saying that there are a lot of ish that goes on behind the scenes that Ari doesn't speak about. But when it came to Ye, it was so happy to stand up for Ye. And then when that Dana White story came out and he did not get involved or say anything for some people that was him exposing his true guts and true intention so Ari is definitely not looking good at this point amongst his people but are we here to talk about that man heck no we're not gonna ruin our day with that man and his you know mind games we're gonna talk about a black king that is about to make a major move along with his wife because guess what for the first time in Ye's relationship history. I'm not talking about the girls before Kim. For the first time since Kim and after Kim, I believe that he truly has someone that sincerely lines, aligns with him from a talent and a skill standpoint. I believe that both of them, you know, have this amazing chemistry, not just in the bedroom, but outside their work, creativity, ideas insights influence i believe that both of them shares so much when it comes to that and i also believe that um we have a lot more to see coming from this amazing couple and guess what kim is about to insert herself like you know what because that woman decides that she's not gonna leave this man alone and whenever ye is trending guess who wants to be trending in the middle of that if you said kim you got that right because if you remember the other day when we learned that ye signed a new deal with adidas kim was there working out in a gym you know with yeezy slides like who works out in slides especially when you know you're on certain exercise equipment you want something to protect your toes in case something heavy should fall right god forbid but you could definitely see that she was just being a narcissist and just trying to ride on this man's wave when this man was canceling her um kim, when this man was being canceled kim was at the elm of the cancellation train right candice always told us that she had to make that pose her and her family but then where we saw kim working 
on her own to cancel this man was the moment that she put on that Adidas shirt, those Balenciaga boots, and she was there posing as though she's saying, yes, good for you. I am not sorry for you. I told you you were nothing without me because Kim wanted to play that narcissist role in that moment. She wanted the world to believe that yeah, his entire career and his entire life, his entire skills, everything that he achieved was because of her. When we know that she has no talent or the ones that she was given by God, she refuses to tap in them, but she continues to open her legs to. So it goes to show the type of woman that this man has been dealing with for all these years. But guess what? It is over and done, and I'm happy that it is. But she's going to consistently ride on this wave. I believe that Kim has some insight about what is about to come, and that's the reason why she's acting as though she's friends with Bianca. She's happy that Bianca is making this man happy, when in reality, she's just, you know, a clout chaser about to use Bianca's name for fame and reputation. But guess what? Ye is not going to sit aside or stand aside and allow to play that narcissist game. He knows how she is. He knows who she is and her family. And like hell, he's not going to allow Kim to do that to his wife. When Kim can do it to him, Ye, and get away with it, she will not be able to do that to his wife and get away with it, right? So, Sensei... <laughs> <laughs> that is Ye's new name. I'm understanding Ye and Bianca. Sensei is coming back and is coming back with something that we have never, well, it's not we have never, we've ne never been. He's coming back with something that, even though we know that he's great, he's talented, he's amazing, we're not ready. And I don't think we will ever be, but whatever it is, yay, we're ready. I mean, we're anticipating. We cannot wait. And he knows that his people are rooting for him. But the name Sensei, though, it's cute. It's fun. And I cannot wait to see this couple in an interview, okay? But guys, guess what? Enough of my shouting. My apologies for the background noise. You know, that's how it is sometimes. But guess what? Ye is coming back. Bianca is coming back. They're coming with something amazing. We're not ready, but we're going to make ourselves ready. And we will be cheering them on. Okay? See you all next time. Peace.